Grammy Award winner Ed Sheeran, 30, admitted he used to be very reckless in the early years of his fame, with actions that could have landed him in some serious trouble. By no fault of his own of course, but some of his choices could have put him in harm's way. The bad habits hitmaker recalled how he used to be very blase about security, and go to bars and clubs by himself after his gigs during his multiply tour in 2014 and 2015. Speaking on the Halfcast podcast, he looked back at his decisions and wondered how he didn't run into trouble. Tour for me on the multiply tour, that was when it was really reckless, he grinned. I didn't have security and it was only me touring. All my touring crew were like 50 and not wanting to go out to clubs, so I would finish a show and head out on my own. But now in 2021, and as one of the most successful singers in the world, he acknowledged just how naive his decisions were, even back then. Very reckless, he shook his head. I could have got robbed, kidnapped or anything. More recently though, the flame-haired pop star has been getting used to a more settled down life, after marrying his wife Cherry Seaborn and now raising their one-year-old daughter, Lyra. Ed is a pretty private guy, but fans were over the moon when he shared a few rare insights into life with baby Lyra back in September. As he joined Kiss Breakfast to promote his new single Shivers, the talk quickly turned to fatherhood. Ed smiled, it has completely flown, but this is what every parent says. Dot they're just like, oh, you know, it flies by, but really I feel like I've blinked and something like. He trailed off as he grinned and shrugged. And with the release of new music means Terry's a mammoth tour around the world on the cards, but he revealed Hess set on taking both Cherry and Lyra with him. I've got a long tour coming up so I think by that time she'll probably start primary school, and, well have been around the world like three or four times, he chuckled. So, I think it's probably time to settle, then, and have a normal childhood I think. It's clear family time means a lot to the singer, who has strict working schedules he sticks to religiously. Speaking on the Halfcast podcast, he said, The other night my wife was in LA and we had a Mexican takeaway and were in bed at 8. 30 p.m. It was like the perfect evening. My work now is very structured. I work 9 to 5. I go into work at 9 a.m. and finish at 5 p.m., no matter what. Ed went on, some producers work mad hours and I say to them, if you don't show up at 9 a.m. or between 9 a.m. and 10 a.m., I am off. We are either working or not working, 